So you have one of these new standard definition flash memory or hard drive camcorders and they're great. They fit in the palm of your hand. You don't have to worry about tapes or DVDs and uh, they take great video and they're affordable. But the trouble comes when you want to get the video from these onto your computer. You find that if it's a JVC, a Canon or a Panasonic, it saves the video in a strange MOD file format and uh, you could always use the program it comes with but you'll probably find that the capabilities are very limited and some of the features like the direct YouTube upload might even, not even work at all. So I'll show you a few tricks I've learned in using these camcorders and getting those MOD files converted to a standard MPEG-2 file without needing to re-encode them and uh, it especially helps if you're shooting any video in widescreen it'll get you the correct aspect ratio because if you just try to upload the MOD file directly to YouTube if it's a widescreen video you probably find that the aspect ratio is only coming up as 4 by 3 it's not coming up as widescreen so, but there's a very easy utility I use called SD copy so in a second I'll show you on my computer how that works Okay, on this JVZ here, I made two quick test videos in widescreen. Now I'll hook it up to the computer and show you how to use SD copy. You just take your USB cable and you plug it in and it, it'll pop up a menu. And on this one, you say playback on PC. And the computer will recognize the USB device. Now if you install the software that came with it, it'll probably pop up the program, but you can just close it out. In fact, you can probably uninstall that program once you learn how to use the stuff I'm showing you here. Now the first program I use is called SD Copy. It's a freeware program. It's very small. It's totally free. And I'll include a link on to where you can find it. Uh, there's various options here. The first thing you need to set is the source directory which tells it where to find the video files on your camcorder. Usually that's going to be on it somewhere called removable disk. On this computer it's E. And then you look for SD video. And under SD video you look for PRG 001. That's where this camcorder saves the files. And then you go back to uh, SD copy here and you set the target directory. I uh, just set it to my documents. Notice here it says rename MOD to MPG. And also set widescreen flag 16 by 9. If you're taking any videos in widescreen, you want to have this checked. If you're taking videos in standard 4x3, leave it unchecked. And you can also set to copy all files or manual selection. I just say all files. And then you just go down here to start and it'll quickly copy the files from the camcorder onto your computer and there it's already done. So now we go to my documents and you'll see those two MPG files right there is what it copied from the camcorder. So now we can play them in any media player there's one I just made to make sure the aspect ratio is correct. Now other brands save videos in other formats. For example, Samsung is now using a MP4 format, which does not work with the, the programs I've shown here. In that case, you'll need to uh, investigate other options for editing those, those files. But the main issues I'm trying to help you with in, these, in this video mostly relate to JVC, Canon and Panasonic because those are the three brands that save the videos in MOD format. So I hope this helps. If you have any questions, just ask in the comments and I'll do my best to help.